Assalamu alaikum everyone. I hope everyone is staying home and safe in this COVID situation. First, let me introduce myself. I am Kaji Amit Hassan, studying in the Department of Computer Science and Engineering at Rajshri University of Engineering and Technology, UAE. Presenting you my research paper, Classification of Parkinson's Disease by Analyzing Multiple Vocal Feature Sets. The authors are myself, Kaji Amit Hassan, and my supervisor, Muhammad Al Mehdi Hassan, Professor of Department of Computer Science and Engineering, UAE. So, without any further delay, let's jump into the presentation. Well. These are the outlines of my whole presentation, and I am going to discuss all the topics throughout this session. Now, introduction. If we analyze our title, we get three keywords, Parkinson's disease, vocal features, and classification. Parkinson's disease is a growing and chronic neurodegenerative disease with a great amount of motor and non-motor symptoms. It caused by early death of dopamine in our brains. In this figure, we can see that difference of dopamine presence between healthy and Parkinson's patient. Now, what is PD? Well, there are some early signs of PD, like change in handwriting, tremor, vocal problems that we have used in this paper, stiffness and slow movements, change in posture and sleeping problems, etc. Now, motivation part. Well, Motivation means what drives us to work on this field. Well, it is the second most common neurological disorder after Alzheimer's. Every year, about 60,000 Americans are diagnosed with this. You can see the geographical heat map of PD affected people. Countries like Finland, Ireland, US, UK has the highest rate of PD. Now, on the left hand side, we have a bar chart of PD affected people, which shows that people from 65 to 79 years age, male, female, both are at risk of PD. Along with this, it has high mortality rate. It also has a risky complication like traumatic falls, infection, sepsis, pneumonia. Most victims are diagnosed at the last stages, but if we can diagnose them at the early stages, then we can survive them. Well, this increases the necessity of early diagnosis. Now, there are some existing problems, like still no effective solution of PD is discovered, and the clinical analysis are very time consuming, and it also has a very high cost, and it needs some experienced manpower. So, the purpose of our research is to develop an intelligent system that can classify PD patients. To contribute in medical sector and reduce the cost of overall clinical analysis and diagnose them in early stages. And we want to reduce the mortality rate Then, last but not the least, we want to employ our proposed model in which it will produce a better performance than the existing ones. So now why vocal feature sets? Well, out of all those existing features, vocal features are most prominent. 90% of PD people face vocal problems in the early stages. The symptoms are low tones, hoarse voice, 10 decibel lower in volume than every listener, slurred speech in advanced stages. Well, these are the previous works that have been done in this field. So, now the overall workflow. This is the overall workflow of our proposed method. First, we are loading the data then pre-processing them by analyzing the correlations and eliminating the correlated features. Then extracting the feature by using analysis of variance, which is also known as ANOVA, and selecting the top 50 features among the 752 features, just like the base paper. Then fit those features into different machine learning models to get the accuracy. Now, the data set description. The dataset was taken from UCI Machine Learning Repository and it contains vocal features of total 130 male and 122 female of PD and healthy individuals. And the age range of PD patients are 33 year to 87 years and 41 to 82 years are of healthy patients. It also contains 752 features. These features are gathered by using microphone with the three repetition of vowel A. Now, 
the data set people think about. The right figure represents that the data set is balanced in terms of gender's perspective. And it has 130 males and 122 females. And the left side image shows that there is a high correlation among the data and we eliminated some unnecessary columns. So now the feature selection. We have implemented analysis of variance ANOVA method to select the topmost features. The top features according to their F score is shown in the left-sided figure. We can see that MFCC, TQWT, vocal and some baseline features are the most significant features than others. The right side correlation heat map was generated after applying the ANOVA. This also solves the correlation problem. Now, the results section. The topmost features were fed into the different machine learning methods. We achieved the highest accuracy 91% with random forest, and our work is also compared with the other existing papers. So now we also got AOC score of 0 0.83 with random forest and 0 0.86 with decision tree. So now the future scopes. We want to provide a web server for our method. Then we want to apply our process onto more data sets and we want to implement different machine learning methods. And in the conclusion, you can say that early detection of PD can reduce the fatality rate. TQ, WT, MFCC, vocal fold, and other baseline features are the most significant features. And we can also reduce the other complications that come with PD. Well, these are the references that I have used in the slides. Thank you everyone for listening. Please stay home and stay safe.